Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to set pagination in your Laravel application. So in this video tutorial I will show you first of all we are getting all our Laravel applications users record and then after set pagination in our table. So let's start. First of all we are created one dub one test route for so all user records so route colon colon get that user and this route call from controllers that users function and then after we are created that user function in our home controller. Simply here public function remove this and then after we are use here user model so simply write f and user and then after we are also created users model object simply type this colon user and in this constructor we are create new object for user model and then after open our user model and simply write here one method for get all record so simply pop public function and then after I am created one new method for get all user records get all users and in this function we are write our business logic so colon colon Left all users reports and then after return this user object and then after use this get user method in our home control so simply we already create our user model object so we are simply using user model function easily that user user and after check here, dd and print our user of what's happening. Slash now I'm check. And the copy this route then first of all I am login. User one at the and then after right here the get user route and look at here we are getting successfully all users records and then after 
I'm display this report in our view file. So simply pass your return view and user list. User list is our view file name. And then after we have that here pass your user into the form tab function this user object so we can use uh, easily use in our user object in our user list view file so now we are creating user list view file in our view folder open resource open view and simply here create new file control s user list dot blade dot yes. and then after possibly I am use the year extend thing layout app and then after section and then and section and into the section we have create one a create layout so class container into the container I have copy some HTML from another file Here one tables plus table table heading dot First here is we are set name and user name. Here name and here name. Into the T body I simply here that one condition. If our user object not empty and 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 for Starting another TR and TV and 
guys now I'm get this and change to the here so guys name and email but here nothing so any data so get here and what's happening Oh guys, now I am. Oh guys, here our all five records listed, but look at here. Here nothing so any pagination. So how to do it? So first of all, go back. In your user controller, and then after that, here, yes. simply and how to make it. I only to record. Okay, guys. Now we are showing only two records, but not showing here our pagination layout so how to get it go back in your and simply copy and paste here And then after step, the first this page. Oh, guys, look at here. Now it's working. So, what is doing? I am right now. First of all, we are create one route, and then after create one get user function in our home, home controller and into the home controller first of all we have use use user model f user and then after create one press object and then after using this object we are call user models get user user function and into the get user function we are right for select all user and set here page in it to and then after return it and then after we have return one view and user list and into the view function we also that pump pack and into the pump pack we use user object so we can easily get all we can easily use 
user object in your lead file and then after we are creating user list lead file in our view view folder and into the view file we are simply write some html code and simply write here user link i i use this code for show this paginet layout so thank you guys for watching this video and please don't forget subscribe my youtube channel thank you